So this is random. Well, let's keep going then. On with the show. <coughs> oh, what's going on here? All right, so here's what it looks like so far. <coughs> Oh crap, I think it's in the way. Um, oh goodness, a bit laggy. Usually it's when it first starts. Um, hmm, oh, what am I gonna do? That's not gonna work, <laughs> like I was hoping. Hmm. Well, that's fun. <laughs> hmm. Let's see here. can make that little ant mine thing I was going to. 
Why is everything in the way, I swear? <laughs> I'm probably not gonna leave this floor texture, so... I'll just move stuff around a bit. <laughs> So glad I grouped this. Oh, it did. Okay. Alright, so... <coughs> I need it right there. Ah, screw you. Shift drag. <laughs> that side's gonna be a lot shorter than I was expecting it to be. <laughs> I'll move this over a bit. Where's that texture? <coughs> um, it's near the sign. It is. <laughs> Screw you. No, not eight ninety. My goodness. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Oh. Do this. Tiny. There you go. <coughs> <coughs> Alright, now let's get our arrows. So I, there's three of these arrows, but the one that works is signage overlay arrow. Hmm. Found it. Amazing. <coughs> Alright, so this one... <coughs> I think this one makes it go forward. I don't remember. This one makes it go forward. Oh, come on, you. Ant lines, ant lines, ant lines, where is it? There it is. entities with this one. I can't do that. Um, never does that except for when you don't want it to, which is very rare.
So you've got the obvious ant lines, but where it's going to get complicated. <coughs> Alright. What do we do? <laughs> I forgot what it's called. That's not what I was expecting it to be, but whatever. <coughs> <coughs> Beautiful thing about Hammer, it doesn't matter. You can have things a little off. And nobody cares. Because you can't notice, you, you don't notice anyway. We've got a half an ant line somewhere. Alright, so something Valve has done. A little trick. You go hell that line, texture lock, and then you increase it that eensy bit. So you don't have a half an ant line. It's stretched a little bit, but you can't really tell. <laughs> it's such a gradual change that I see what you're doing with the ant line. What? Oh, that's why. That's what he was saying. <coughs> All right, we need this here, here, <coughs> and we need one wall and one floor. Oops. I don't know why it matters, but one says wall and one says floor, so I, you figure that it makes a difference. <laughs> yeah, that's one brush. Why did it look at this thing cut off? Oops. So there's your ant line. <coughs> there's what it looks like. Now, as for the function. <coughs> this is gonna be fun. First thing I need, well actually three of them. No. Oh. Take your toggle. All right. Bam. Where are you? Bam. And... <laughs> Put it here. Make it close. <coughs> Where are we? <coughs> Can't tell where anything is in here, I swear. So now each ant line needs a name. <coughs> no, not cube. Glowing signage. Well, it kind of is. There's a few ways you could do it. 
No. No. Really. Alright. <coughs> that, this, oh. Might help to hold control and actually select everything. <laughs> this we're gonna call... I think funnels to ends. I don't know. This possibly PT for texture toggle, obviously. <coughs> Bam. Outputs, objects. <coughs> Unpressed. <laughs> Text index one. This one zero. <coughs> Is that on? Do one more. Funnel. <laughs> Next one. Button reset. Zero. <laughs> Alright, so now we copy these. They say work smarter, not harder. Based. <coughs> Alright, so now obviously we want to. The funnel, uh, funnel lights are gonna be the same. Uh, reverse, <coughs> set texture index, one, forward, zero. <sighs> Burb. <coughs> so now, when you hit this button, these lights turn orange and stay orange. And this turns on, but it turns off a second after. But these will stay on. And when you hit this one, then these turn orange, and these turn back to normal, and then this goes and on and off in a second. <coughs> I actually could test it. If I closed it up real quick, I could do it. <coughs> For testing purposes, let's do that. Wait. Need it accessible. Why don't I just make the wall a portal surface? See, where are we? Over there. Bam. Bam. <coughs> Obviously it's gonna look like crap for a minute, but we'll fix that. <coughs> this is for testing purposes only. Alright, so, <coughs> a few different compiles here. It's a really nice thing to have. Um, it's a fast compile. Lighting looks like crap, but then again there won't be any lighting. <coughs> <coughs> uh, 
And apparently there's a leak, so that's nice. Alright, where did I forget? Is that the top of the door? That's the top of the door. Ugh. It's always gotta be something, I swear. Can't just cooperate. Not even one. This has always gotta be a leak. There we go. Nope, never mind. Uh, <laughs> I got the top of that, but I forgot the bottom. Congratulations. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, it goes out that far. Okay. It's funny, I was in the same place. Alright, once more. Save first. In case something happens while it's compiling. I always save before I compile, because one time, it would crash whenever I tried to compile it. Apparently, I had a colon instead of a semicolon. Yeah, it's that important. <laughs> Apparently. Can I just... Yeah, of course. But you think you get everything, and then you don't. Yeah, you go and you go to compile and you're like, oh no, there's nothing I could have forgotten. And then it leaks. There, finally. Didn't think that would ever happen. <coughs> there are some lights in the map. I just gotta turn on Fulbright. I just gonna look like crap, but whatever. <laughs> oh, the glass. I don't know if you need a bigger spot to shoot through, but I figured I'd just leave the funnel like that for now. And if it can, if it needs to be changed, it can be. It's not very difficult. It's gonna be so dark in here. I swear. Where am I? Why am I in this box? <laughs> At least I didn't have far to go. Where's the elevator? Oh goodness. Oh, that's why, because I don't have the logic in. I forgot. Forgot all about it. And I also didn't put the trigger to open the door. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this should start orange. Actually, no, that should start orange. Well, that works. <laughs> Alright, what did I do wrong? I clearly forgot how to do this. This is why we test stuff. Target brushes, how about that? Ive I think I did a quick compile.
there. <coughs> also, I'm going to put in a logic auto. <laughs> Although I don't know why it has to start in reverse. <laughs> I don't know, whatever. Spawn point is a completely closed cube. It actually is a completely closed cube. Always. But when you have the elevator logic in, it transports you to the elevator. There's a thing in it that transport you and the portal gun and everything. Alright, um... This. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Seh. <coughs> so that's going to start it and start the correct lights and color <coughs> alright so if you remember what happened last time if I take this elevator shift drag to make another thingy and then An elevator, what is it? <laughs> this Have a little bit of logic. Try this. Little Here's your elevator. Got to change the instancing. There you go, that doesn't look like crap. I've got all this logic and stuff in here. <coughs> and I need a thing to open the door. <coughs> fun, fun, fun. <coughs> C4 wide by... 96 tall. <coughs> Funny thing, there's a brush right here which will open the door, but it doesn't have a good timing in it, so I like to put my own. <coughs> that way, as soon as people hit it, the door opens and they don't have to wait for the door to open. Ah, crap. Oops. What happened there? That couldn't be much simpler, really. <coughs> Alright. Pile again. Save it. In case I already didn't, because apparently I forgot. <laughs> One twenty two num portals, which isn't that bad for as small a map it is, I suppose. Map Ah <laughs> uh, two you go both sides. There right now and watch what happens. There you go, and you're on the elevator. This one's on. <coughs> you push this one. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Come over here. Push this one. There you go. <laughs> That's how it's supposed to work. <laughs> That's 
Surf physics funny. thing <laughs> so that's what I was thinking of last night it's really not very complicated it just takes some time to do <laughs> that's funny I'm always the elevator it's like oh yeah it's not in here yet I didn't put it in 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 okay Got that cube dropper. Also, I don't think you need two laser cubes in this map. <laughs> like watching this stream. This big hole right here. <laughs> Alright, delete that and delete that and continue. <laughs> well, actually, that one I want to leave. <clears throat> Alright, so how was the, the other map? I probably open it. If only it actually looked like that. Doesn't load anything. If you can't make the funnel blue on the non door side, how will you be able to finish the test? If you can't make the funnel blue, That's how your test was, though. Obviously, I can't load workshop maps in the dev version, so... Get out. And open regular Portal 2. Loads and loads of maps to load. The Petite Magician. Why do I still have this map? I thought I played it. <laughs> no, can you, can you let me click Q? <laughs> Please? Oh, God. It's bad enough the scroll wheel doesn't work, and then the, the mouse can't click either. Quitely. I never did finish this map. Someone said it wasn't really very good. It looked good, but the puzzle wasn't very good. Except then you would need to be really fast getting onto the button. I could have sworn this test only had one way. Or do both of them toggle it? If they both toggle the funnel, then... Then obviously this logic isn't going to work. I think they do, actually. That sucks, that means I'm gonna have to redo it. Oh, I'm gonna have to remove it. Dang it! They toggle it! I hate you! Why couldn't you have said something about that before? I 
I'm skipping this song because I don't like it. It's stupid. You could just add another button to each side. I don't want to do that. And... <coughs> well, that's what I get. Where's Hammer? Hammer! They are. Uh, I hate you. I know, it looks so nice, too. You couldn't have told me that before. Couldn't have thought of it before, either. Bye, goodbye, 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 goodbye. Rip, rest in pieces. <coughs> There's a slightly different way we'll be doing it. I think the laser is better there anyway. I'll just leave the laser. <coughs> Alright. <coughs> so there is an entity that you can toggle. And LP Freaky told me about it. <laughs> like you put it in skin. I worked together with someone to create it. <coughs> um. Alright, what is it? It's logic something. Branch, I believe. Right there. <laughs> right, so I don't remember exactly how this thing works. No. No clue how to do that. You have to. Well, if you want it custom, you have to find someone that can make one for you. Miss pressing buttons and then needing to sit through ads. Mm, okay. <coughs> <coughs> Alright. Untrue. Any <laughs> force? 235. Initial <laughs> value. <coughs> that means we don't need these. Either of them. <laughs> I think it's toggle test. One. Same thing with this. Get of all of them. <laughs> that looks so nice. Um, what am I doing? The same outputs. Things we don't need this name either. It's not going to be receiving any outputs. <coughs> Dang leaks! Oh. Well, that one's my fault. Hmm. <laughs> 
That I deleted the wall. Oh. A wall? How stupid does she think we are? Oh. Looks crappy. Whatever. It's dark anyway, you can't see it. Okay, once again. Well, I'm not going to use full bright, because it doesn't matter. Alright, what's going on? I don't think I should have been in- whoops. <laughs> go from there. There you go. That might work. <coughs> I wish the time was on both monitors. I use a smaller monitor for the Twitch and the chat, but <coughs> it's like I can't see it. <coughs> Beam. should turn that. <clears throat> oh goodness. Yeah, I should rotate that. Because this one is like the funnel's going that way. Which it is, but then this one, it's like the funnel's going that way, except it isn't. It's the little details that set people aside from each other. Oops. There you go. <laughs> okay, dokie. Well, that's that, I guess. I think it's the same song. It's like a different version. That's too complicated. You got all this mess going on. It's like, I'd rather have no ant lines. If you can make it simple, then okay, but I really prefer not to have any if I can help it. It just looks cleaner without them. So it doesn't seem like there's any point in this puzzle that you use both laser. But, but, <coughs> you, you use both of these laser cubes as laser cubes. 
So do you really need two laser cubes? The first thing that drops obviously has to be a laser cube. Because <laughs> you need it for the laser. <coughs> But you get the moon. <clears throat> and you have this cube that pretty much just sits on the button, and you don't really use it as a laser cube. I think the one over here should be a little more obvious. <laughs> it's like no light actually in here. That's funny. Something must be just creating some kind of light. But it should be more obvious that this is here and what it does. <coughs> because you pretty much need to do that first thing. <coughs> Alright, and that one drops a cube. The other cube. <laughs> Alright, so now you have three cubes, and now the test progresses quicker. <coughs> also, that is not just an auto respawn. <laughs> so... <coughs> it's kind of an all three. They kind of all are. Or are they? Failing. <laughs> Up. I can't. There you go. <laughs> oh, that's that one. That's funny. I thought that one was that one. There you go. <coughs> so they're all a lot of respawn. Well, those two are. I don't know about this one. No, that one is an auto respawn. I mean, it's not very hard to get that cube, but still. I need the other one. Where's the other one? <coughs> uh, two fabs. A for to respawn. B for everything else. Back to the ant lines. Never mind the outlines. I it didn't work like I was hoping it would, so <laughs> just forget it. <coughs> it's a pity, but whatever. Ah, I grouped them. No, I didn't. It's too high, isn't it? No. It's the right height, so where's, why is there a hole? I did over too far. Huh. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so the logic in this one... Oh crap. Mm. 
I don't remember how I set up the logic in this. So it's like I have to go back into it and catch it again. <coughs> Why don't I just set animation? I don't even know. <coughs> I think it's item dropper open. Disable. <coughs> I guess it's this. Oops. I don't know why I didn't just make this one brush. I mean, one entity. Just with a different delay on it. I forget. See, this only needs to be once. <coughs> you know what? Well, I'm going to make that the one because that doesn't make any sense. I should get to have two of these open at the same time because I don't remember which is which. Two. I'm gonna have. I don't know. Let's, let's start with two. We gotta start somewhere. My ear is so itchy. No. Dos. Dos vidanya. Down there. That's two vidanyas. Eat. <coughs> so what we're dealing with here <coughs> Disable <coughs> So people, oh there he is the test is really dark right now. It's not dark, there just aren't any lights. <coughs> Alright, copy and paste. <coughs> Three seconds. There you go. <coughs> so it turns itself off and then it turns itself back on. So if people go da 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 da, -da with a the laser, they can't screw up the the dropper thing. <laughs> to make my own version of your test. <laughs> 
So I guess this isn't set to auto respawn. <laughs> Which is fine because. <laughs> Because it's not like that in the map anyway, but <coughs> all you'd have to do is add a few outputs to the cubes, telling it to drop again. I published under friends only. I need to play it next week when I have access. <laughs> BSOD. <laughs> Every time I see BSOD, I think you're saying a bad word, but it's like, no, that's blue screen of death. <laughs> There's nothing bad there. I need to unload this po uh, point file. No. Hit unload. Thank you. It could be auto respawn. <coughs> uh, the thing is, it's not hard to get it back. So it's like, it's it's essentially like pushing a button. So it could just be like it is, really. That's why I'm thinking of just leaving it. <coughs> I'm thinking of pushing this wall back a bit, but then this thing's here. right in the wall <laughs> right well I'm gonna take this rail down the back way see you at the bottom good luck right, that's going through there <coughs> this is going through there well that's nice oh well make a little bitty bash Go like this. I'm going to do a diagonal. Oh, never mind. Oh crap. Oh crap, it's not all the way down. Oh, shit. Alright, let's put this over in the corner. I did change some things. There's no elevator and funnel is on a timer. <coughs> I'm already thinking about how to solve it. Well, I'm still trying to think of this one, so... <laughs> one map at a time, please. Not really a repeat, but you know what I mean. <laughs> that was a perfect position. Alright. <coughs> so we've got the two cubes. This one needs to be a laser cube, though. It's called. Up weighted cube. Oh, never mind. They put it in here. <laughs> okay. 
cube type. One at a time, stop also thinking about remaking Eurotrain Cube and Hammer and hating auto incorrect. Eh? I don't get it. Wait, like, what are you getting at? I don't know why that's like that, but it always, it turns out right, it's, it's funny. Clean. Use new skins. Use the values. New type and skin fields instead of skin old field. So I guess, I, I don't know man. If I got rid of this, no. Never mind. I just can do that. Turn this off. I, do, I don't know. I don't know, man. I really don't. <coughs> <coughs> so this is also not going to be auto respawn because well, it doesn't really need to be. Make those a bit wider. I got B mod. <laughs> I'm already hating it. <laughs> well, that's not to my dismay. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> uh, the only reason I say not to get it is because it is such a pain. It's like two hammer. Forget B mod. Seriously, if you ever had thoughts of getting B mod, just forget them and get hammer. It's like it takes a bit longer to learn. But it's so much more worth it. You don't even you don't even know. All right, <coughs> we need <coughs> another button to drop the cube. <coughs> Let's grab this. again <laughs> box dispenser <coughs> is that the only one oh here you go I clicked this, didn't I? Yes, it's going to drop it up. Gee. Round. <coughs> what I'll do in the stage, like that. Oh, it's floating.
fun, boom. Someone sent a message. We'll go ahead and play with him. Oh, he's probably not here. Whatever. <laughs> I have Windows 10. Boot camp. I use a Mac. I know people that use Mac and have and have Hammer, and it works just fine for them. <coughs> so I'm gonna do it this way around instead. There you go. <coughs> you got a little sideways button. <laughs> it's nice to have little offsets like that. You could create a thing that opens up in the floor and shoots a cube. <laughs> I'm not doing that. <laughs> uh, um, what's it called? I think a time machine has the cube droppers on the floor. Well, they're not droppers. They're like cube creators. It's actually kind of an interesting game. I was thinking about it earlier. point of having that was that you didn't have to have custom ceiling or whatever. You could edit the ceiling. Well that looks odd. Never mind. Oops. Let's grab this. Save. Almost impossible to save too much in this thing. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Fine, I'll just leave it like that then, if you don't want to cooperate. What for tip testing initiative? Is there a way to edit Q physics so they don't bounce when they land? Um, you can't really edit physics. <laughs> Unless you want to edit the scripts in the game, and I wouldn't recommend that at all. <coughs> Wait a minute. This. So we've got the height that we need. Actually, do this. Hello. Make the cube kind of in a a bucket, if you will. Obviously, you got lights and stuff that you gotta add, but since since, since what this button does is in front of it, you don't really need that line. I mean, you could have an outline, but you don't really need it. Now, this dropper is definitely going to need an outline because. <laughs> It's off the side. Alright, let's see how this looks. Where is it? Portal. Why is it still running? <coughs> you got that dropper over there. <laughs> so you're kind of a slot, kind of like that. And um, that. No, that's a reflection cube. Reflection. That isn't.
redirection cube. You've got this little slot in here. The laser goes in. This map. Ooh, a bunch of funny little stuff. <coughs> So we need a little cube dropper. Oh no, I said cube. <coughs> I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. <coughs> Copy that one more time. Oh. Copy the roof as well to make it easier on ourselves. <coughs> Whoops. Same height as the other one. This texture is the wrong way. <laughs> yes, it is. Lunch. No, no, I like my textures all facing the same way. Thank you. Seems good. <coughs> what you can do if you want to move both, you can use the the vertex editor thingy, and then that will move the ones at different different lengths, and keep the shorter one the same size. Exactly. <sighs> My God, you didn't cooperate once, like ever. Would really appreciate if you did, you know. You mean a lot to me. 
don't know why you can't, but apparently you don't like to a whole lot. <laughs> Still though, I would appreciate it. <coughs> Close! See? You see what I'm talking about? <laughs> I'm exaggerating, it doesn't like to operate. Put in that nice wall over here. Ah, <coughs> 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 Um, <coughs> I may just put the wall there, actually. No, 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 I want this. Sometimes I wish it would just do no job whenever you do stuff. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, so now we've got a big wall here. It might be too big, actually. <laughs> I don't know. I wish that was possible to draw brushes in the void. Responding. No! No, 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 I did it! <laughs> you crashed on me! Why did that even happen? Oh, we have first crash of the day. This song sounds weird. Open. My goodness. Don't do this to me now. Yes, it auto saves, but it's better to just save yourself. My god, Hammer, come on and respond. To close the program, it doesn't. Maybe you were in the cube dropper. I wasn't in the cube dropper. And even if I was, it wasn't selected. <laughs> Are you really doing this to me, OBS?
<laughs> Not sure. Oh, there it goes. It's back. Good. It's just hammer opening and being slow. Void is evil. That's all that matters. It doesn't matter if you just click on the void. That's not what makes it crash. <coughs> I think it was just my stream. <coughs> because hammer was opening so it wasn't displaying the stream. No, it's good. What are you doing? Hammer, come on! Why are you being like this? What? What? I lost all of that? I could have sworn I was saving. Oh my goodness, that sucks. I suppose not really that much, but still, it sucks. Oh my goodness. I told you it doesn't like to operate. And nobody listens to me. They just ridicule me and act like I'm crazy. And it's like, while I don't entirely disagree with that, that doesn't mean that Hammer's nice. so laggy <laughs> oh please fix when portal to authoring tools gets out of beta that's funny. When? Uh, yeah. Valve and their... Their unwillingness to finish stuff that they started. Everyone thinks it's so funny. Ah. Uh, Aha. Uh -huh. Anyway. Goodbye. The funnel looks weird. Why does the funnel look weird? Just hammer once you get a certain distance from things, models they turn into boxes. You can increase or decrease the distance, but it does that so that it's not using if your map's like really huge, it doesn't render everything in it and really slow down hammer. As it is, hammer doesn't run very fast, so.
Fizz leaves? No. Already did. Like a map that is all of Portal One without loading screens. <laughs> Not that big. Can you play test maps before you publish them? Well, yeah. I compiled it and tested it a few times a minute ago for these buttons. I made this too. Well, I was working on it until it crashed on me. tiles. Why is it so hard to sit up straight? So you know, I don't. I'm not slouching because it's fun. So I'm doing it. <coughs> it's again. <sighs> Come on, man. Sit up straight. It's not that difficult, is it? Time you move, you slouch a little. <laughs> You've got to hold your breath to stay sitting up straight. It's the only issue with making things offset like that. You've got textures like this that don't fit. For me, I don't like it when textures are only half on the wall. Just make the wall longer to fit the texture. I don't want to. I like it looking odd. It probably would look better that way. I don't know.
means I didn't switch this either. Yes, I did. Ah, oh, crap, I didn't copy the ceiling. Mine's why. Sorry, forget. I don't have a whole lot of those squares, do I? Do I bother putting both? My god. <laughs> I caught that Pink Floyd reference. What? I made a Pink Floyd reference? <laughs> I don't even remember. I just say stuff, I don't pay attention. Like, did I say that? I didn't realize. <laughs> One here that will make a little garage door in. Don't forget to save, thank you. <laughs> so, what Pink Floyd reference? Clearly, I didn't catch it. Even though I said it. Well, I don't remember it. Way up because we don't need stupid leaks in the map. <coughs> <coughs> There's this one map. My fr this one, fr uh, this guy I know made. Um, it has this cube. You go into this room to get the cube, and every time people take the cube out of the room, even though all you have to do is move it a few feet onto a button in that same room. <laughs> I thought you said. I said eins, zwei, drei, vier. That's one, two, three, four in German. <laughs> Which, uncoincidentally, the guy who did the album we're listening to, album, the music we're listening to, is also German, so. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think of how I'm going to do this. This little room. Oh, it's too too much. Too 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 too. It's a two two. No, it's a two two and two two's are evil. Anyway. <coughs> there you go. <coughs> the laser needs to go down a little hallway. sure exactly how many to do that. I knew what it meant. Okay, well, it wasn't really a reference. <laughs> <laughs> Not to anything I know about, at least. Just 
counting in a different language. I keep threatening to learn German, but then I never actually do it. I still like it though. I think it's a cool language. It's actually very similar to English. I'm instead of fear. No, I didn't. Sorry to disappoint you, but that's not what I said. <laughs> this part is weird. Yep. <laughs> You're going to put the laser cube dropper on the right instead of the left. Make the ant lines less confusing. Uh. <laughs> <coughs> if by that you mean I'm going to put a put the catcher the laser catcher for the emancipation grill on this side and for the cube dropper on this side then yes or he could move the laser catcher <laughs> that's what he was talking about <laughs> oh no floating glass it's not floating but it's it's yeah <laughs> it's off. <coughs> Maybe I will switch it around. You can't really switch models though. <laughs> like, I will have to turn every single one of these models, which is actually kind of useful. You can back up, and you've got this big square. It makes it easy to select. <laughs> oh crap! That's. This is going to take a little longer than I thought. One by one, bra. Don't worry, we'll get it. That was what I did in my version as well. Oops. Thank goodness. <laughs> Do these. Last little thing. Alright, now we just need this glass. Go into the smallest grid. And back up. There you go. <coughs> glass is not floating anymore. Which means we could also move this button. Up to the glass. And texture lock's not on, but whatever. <laughs> Aye, that's a bit better. <laughs> that's what I wanted. And what I didn't do in the coop version of the test that has about 1,000 ratings. I guess it's true that great minds don't think alike.
Okay. Stream's got a decent delay. More sharing of ideas, allowing for more knowledge. I don't get what you're getting at. to push this wall out a bit. <laughs> Maybe right here I will. Oops. Right here. We go like this. any sense, which it really doesn't. I think that makes sense, right? Nope. Okay. Okay. Hey. I need an indicator where this laser is going. thing the laser actually looks like the texture on it is actually pretty much that big there you go there's a laser Also change the floor texture below the laser, removing the need for as much trial and error with cube placement. That I did that in one map actually. <coughs> as kind of a <coughs> this is where the laser is going. But 
This map, I'm going for official standards. So I don't think I can get away Ooh, with that here. That looks odd. Catchers. Can't talk today. First hammer, now my vocalizations. Um I try to avoid light ships on the floor if I'm doing official. If I'm doing a more freestyle map than whatever, but if I'm doing a map that I want to look like it came out of the game, obviously you can't really have light ships on the floor. That doesn't really work. Pretty much, if they didn't do it, I don't do it. We've got 128, 60. <coughs> <laughs> oh, I can't really do that, can I? these over a bit. <gasps> Infinite grammar's brandy. <laughs> Some people in your life are just so funny. That's what I did in some of the earlier versions. I also experimented with a square light where the cube goes but found that it was just too bright and had weird lighting on the cube. Isn't there that level after a birthday surprise that has the small redirection cube signs on the floor? That's kind of funny actually. I don't know why exactly they put that sign there. <laughs> birthday surprise. That's actually the first test in the surprise called column blocker. Uh, I think that's when you're talking about at least you actually have access to that file Oops. it's not even decompiled so you even have the instances they used where is it When is this thing going to be done loading? My goodness. There. Right here. I really don't know why they put this sign here. Like, it kind of gives it away. Kind of. Thing is, you're not usually over here. I honestly don't really see a need for this sign. I don't know why they put it. Yeah. 
you come out the elevator and you come into this oh it's dark in here it's it's sticky in here come into this room and then surprise and then you come through here and then this is it's right over here but still I mean they don't have it going all the way across This is kind of a training test, so in some ways, you can put more signages in it. And you can get away with them because you're training the player to do something they haven't done before. But... <coughs> this is a, another variation on the cube base. The button base. <laughs> it's kind of sloppy, actually. <laughs> Got these funny little platforms. I kind of intend for you to put the cube there, but you might not have to necessarily put it in that spot to solve the puzzle. Well, obviously you don't put it right here, you put it like over here, over here a little bit. Still don't really know why they put that there. <laughs> I don't know. It's one of those things, once you know how to solve the puzzle, then it's like, yeah, it makes sense, but while you're learning how to solve the puzzle, it's kind of confusing. <laughs> Interesting they'd put cube maps on both sides of this this glass. I like to look at these maps every once in a while just to like just to see exactly how they did it. A lot of times I'll like copy and paste stuff. Got a sagging spot in the ceiling. I like to think of the wall things, at least for the map I'm working on, as like something fell on the test and it like it pushed it down a little bit or on the side. It it's making it go in a little bit. Obviously you'll have wear just from sitting stuff coming out, but you, like, you do it in sections, kind of like a pier. More or less like these little things. Ooh. These things fell through, and now you've got this broken section around it. So like, it fell on the test, and it broke out some of the wall. You've got like a section of the wall that's, that's um, in disarray. <laughs> this thing, this light right here shining on this spot on the floor. Funny thing, last time I was watching someone, when I was watching someone the other day, I actually saw a little circle right here. <laughs> you don't notice that circle until you look at this. Like, hey, there's a little circle on the ground. It tells you you should shoot a portal there. I wouldn't tell you, tell you, but... You see an idea. Funny roof tiles. The tile, the roof tiles are new, but then the dropper is all old, nasty. <laughs> that makes sense. Let's, let's check this one. Yeah, the same way. New roof tiles, old, dirty dropper. <laughs> so I think I may do that. No, I did do that. Close that. We've done enough looking for now. It's <laughs> more or less what I did. <coughs> <coughs> I 
should make one of these droppers old. I don't know which one. <laughs> Maybe like the first one older. I think it's a different model. This thing takes forever to load. What you do is you close it. For some reason when you close it, it loads faster. Yeah, it's like, it's so much farther than it would have been. <coughs> oh, I don't know where this came from, I really don't. <laughs> It looks like a map editor, the PTI editor thing. I think open. That's when the thing is broken. <laughs> Idle, open, close. This one has the animations. The same animations too, that's what's nice. That you don't have to have different animations. Hit that. Bam. Now it's dirty. Tisk tisk valve lazy. Being too lazy, just sitting on steam income while laughing at everyone waiting on portal three. Battle should place the roof over them. Dropple droppers wouldn't fall off the ceiling. Why would she replace how could she replace the roof that the droppers are connected to, but not replace the droppers themselves? <laughs> That makes sense. <laughs> <coughs> like, wouldn't the dropper fall out if you took the ceiling that is connected to off? Well, Half-Life 3 is no good anyway, so yeah. Yes, I said it. Get over it. And this thing. I'm gonna rotate it a bit. No, it's not what I wanted. Objects. E. This way. <laughs> that way the boat can the size closer to the wall. That way it looks bad, but not so bad. Oh, there's a lot of different things you could do with this. I almost want it facing the other way. I don't know. One in that skull crash. <laughs> okay. Now this is the one who. Says that bringing down real air is too expensive. Well, air and light are two different things. I mean, getting light into a thing is one thing, <laughs> but air is like filters. I don't know. I don't know. Don't ask me.
furnace. Just my phone. Making noise. Noise is fun. Not at all. Hate noise. It's this song. Wait a minute. Late reconstructing, mid, early, overgrown, and clean. I was describing it last time. It's like, it's mostly rebuilt. There's a but there's still a bit that needs to be done, trash laying on the ground, and a few panels that go in, but not the whole thing, just a little bit. There you go. Now we've got one in a three corner instead of a four space. Make it a little offset. It's partially clean. It's mostly clean. It's, a, it's partially destroyed. And I didn't charge my phone. I was supposed to. 4.43. Um... Hmm. Don't do it again. No. No, you've done it again. I hate you. It's always got to be when you don't save, too. Oh. Directory is invalid. Why is it invalid? Like it. Mm. Dang, Steam. Everything's just dying on me. GG everything. I think it was Steam, actually. Steam died for some reason. He took everything along with it. Bet you if I click Portal, it's gonna die too. Laser zigzag. Oh god. I know what it's called too. And what it looks like. Laser chaining is what it's called. More or less. Most of it's clean, but it's got a little bit of dirt, a few panels hanging out. The only thing I don't like about Hammer and decompiling maps is that it kind of ruins the magic of the game. It doesn't hit you the same when you know how everything's done. 
Yes, yes, yes. The test is going to be late reconstructing, as I've said many times. Come on, man. Well, I guess I haven't lost a whole lot. Just moving this back in the corner, it seems. What was the last one before triple laser phase? The only proper clean one in the campaign. Why does everyone call it a campaign? Right in the corner. So, at about five, I'm going to wrap up the stream. I'll be back later this evening. But I'm going to take more or less a break, I suppose you could call it. Um, I should be back. Oh god. Um, I want to say like 7, but seems kind of late. Maybe like 6.30ish, I want to say. Oh, that's too far away. Uh... It should be about 6.30ish. It's like watching the behind the scenes extras in the movie and they show you how they made all the effects. I have some homework as well. <coughs> so about 10 more minutes. And then we'll get going. <coughs> Why do people have to send a K? Like, could you send a less meaningful message? I mean, if you're going to acknowledge it, I mean, I know you saw it. You don't have to say okay or anything. I may miss some of it due to Murdoch Mysteries. Well, I'm not sure exactly when I'll be back. Just as soon as I return, I will start up the stream again. That's pretty much all I can say, because I'm not entirely sure myself. <laughs> Funny little... Little box right here. BOX! <laughs> Do I have this on auto-aim? Actually, we need something to turn it on, too. That button turns it on. <laughs> Um, auto aim. Start off, yes. Just call it laser. Lar. No, not Z. That's the. I want to say okay, but I'm guessing the catcher side is going to be the dirty side because the funnel is a newer element. <coughs> There's not really any sides in particular. <laughs> I'm going to need to watch that. I don't. I don't know. It. You just kind of make it as you go, and then some stuff's new, some stuff's old. It's not really any specific thing in particular. 
<laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna put this button. I need a button. This is a button. Q button. Inset light panel stairs. View button? The view button. Oh, that's my remote view button. <laughs> the regular button. <laughs> I stole Valve's little lights for this button, so. This sounds like Undertale. I meant the something pit movie. Okay. Wait a minute. You ever notice in Return of the Jedi when Vader gets off his shuttle in Endor, his helmet clips through the ship? No, I didn't actually. I mean, it doesn't really surprise me. All that stuff's CGI anyway. But anyway. <laughs> Ah. Yes, it is. <laughs> texture lock. Make sure to turn on texture lock when you're moving stuff. <laughs> right, that should be about good for that button. <coughs> <coughs> you know what I can do, actually? <coughs> 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 Use the at I can make an outline on this button <coughs> and have that be right under the laser. Nah. Right there. So rotate it. Come on. Oh my god! Did I move that so far away? <laughs> ah. This thing, I tell you, it, it just it hates me. It really does. Okay. <coughs> Alright, let's put one over here. <laughs> I'm also making a Portal 2 map. Well, congratulations. <laughs> You're not the only one. <laughs> Having them under laser so you know where to put the cube. <coughs> uh oh. <laughs> That's not good. Door goes through the laser. <laughs> Can't have that. But we'll have to move it over, I guess. Except I don't want to move it over. Just move the door, whatever. Door in the whole dang elevator. And all of this. One, two, three. can't hardly have the, the door going through the laser. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> Whatever. 
I liked the door where it was, but... Can't have everything. Which is really unfortunate, because it would be nice if you could have everything, but... <laughs> you can't. This song's stuck. No. Oh. <laughs> sounded like it was broken for a minute. <laughs> or. Bing. Mm. Oh, that actually didn't have to be off. You know, because of that. I just need to get the brush faces. <laughs> I don't really like that, but whatever. There's a little light that goes on this as well. <coughs> Lights, lights. Um, I think it's five, has it? I'm going to need to properly remake this level as well. Put the exit up a level, and you portaled up to it at the end. Bolian. You're trying to put violin. I think you you messed up. <laughs> you done goofed. I don't have the lights on these. That, oh, that's not good. <laughs> Left no drugs exposed in this map. How dare I? Apparently not the only thing I did wrong. Well, let me take care of that. <laughs> Did I do that over here too? Yes, I did. How dare it? What the heck, man? I can't believe I did that twice. Well, now you know if you ever play this map, you'll get some note draw to find. <laughs> Look at this. Alright, so, whoop. Apparently hit back. My Twitch disappeared. And it's not showing me the stream. That's nice. <laughs> uh, man. If you do one thing wrong. <coughs> what was the map I did the laser light on? I may have done it in that one. I don't know. I'm pretty sure I did the laser light in this one. <laughs> there you go. I know I did it in four. Laser light. <laughs> it's a very faint light. Essentially, the purpose of it is <coughs> the laser emitter has a little bulb around the the laser where it emits and this is that is the light that is being created <coughs> I also did it in three it's funny I didn't do it in five all right oh four button <laughs> the 
right. I believe that's the same outfit. Both of these. And pressed. <laughs> Turn off. Ah, that was quick. <laughs> oh, I need a texture toggle for this ant line. That's not the best thing to do with the ant line. I don't particularly like it, actually. <laughs> but. I, I don't know. They definitely wouldn't do it in the game. Now I just need a billion little blue orange lights. The <laughs> lines emit light. Well, I don't think I would need a billion, but yeah. <laughs> Valve definitely wouldn't do this. <laughs> I mean, I like it, but like I said, if they didn't do it, then I don't do it. Laser two portals. Is there a sign for just the laser? I don't believe so. I don't see if there is. Is there a emitter? Yeah, I'm pretty sure there isn't one. Wireframe. Shader test wireframe? What the heck? This. A bunch of weird textures in here. They really are. I don't know what this is. That's ugly. Oh, it's 504. <laughs> Alright, well. I guess I'll do the texture toggle for this ant line. And end the stream there for now. I'm just gonna leave this here. Oops, for the time being. I think of a way to change it. You can go away anytime, you stupid light. But he doesn't want you. No? Yeah. <coughs> Text toggle. Ah, uh, crap, Suzette. Oh, that's off. Up here. <laughs> to the button, I don't know, whatever. Alright. Copy paste. Oh. I would not name that. This is like the simplest entity to do too. You literally just put it in, name it, and hit this, and that's all you have to do. You don't send outputs. Actually, no, you do send outputs to it. You don't send outputs to this. I don't know, man. Action next. One. Paste. And pressed. Too cool. There you go. Laser light. Laser lights. <laughs> Alright, so that should do it. <coughs> Alright. <coughs> so for now, that's it. We accomplished quite a bit today, actually. Well, right now. The chamber is starting to take shape. <laughs> Hopefully this thing... This song sounds funny.
Hopefully this hole here isn't too hard. <laughs> um, yep, I guess that will do it for now. I will be back, as I said, about 6.30ish. That's not the exact time, maybe a little earlier, maybe a little later. As I'm sure you all knew me by now, I never hit things exactly on time. <laughs> not proud of it but whatever um so yep i will see you all in a few hours hopefully i can hopefully it's not too long